Good day learners! In this lesson, let's learn the name of different types of lines. Look at the white lines on the sides of this strip. These lines go in exactly the same direction. So, the distance between them always stays the same. Do you think these two lines will ever meet? No, they won't. They are called parallel lines. Parallel lines go in exactly the same direction. They always have the same distance between them and never meet at any point at all. Now, let's examine the letter X. Do you notice the two lines that cross each other? These lines are intersecting lines. Intersecting lines cross or meet each other at a certain point. On the other hand, perpendicular lines are defined as two lines that meet or intersect each other at right angles or 90 degrees. These lines can be found when we cut a square-shaped sandwich from side to side. Another example of perpendicular line is the capital letter L. After learning the description of intersecting, parallel, and perpendicular lines, let us practice how to draw these lines using ruler and set square. A ruler can be defined as a tool or device used to measure length and draw straight lines. A set square or triangle is usually plastic or metal device that is shaped like a triangle and used for drawing straight lines and angles. Steps in drawing intersecting, parallel, and perpendicular lines. An intersecting lines. Step 1. Using any of the three devices, draw a straight line. Use a small letter to name the line. Step 2. Create another line passing to any point of the first line and write another small letter for the name of the second line. Parallel Lines Step 1. Draw a line and take a point outside the line. Place any side of the set square forming the right angle along the line. Step 2. Place the ruler along the other side of the set square, forming the right angle. The ruler is to be kept fixed. Step 3. Slide the set square along the ruler upwards such that the point aligns along the arm of the set square. Step 4. Remove the ruler and set square. Then name the two lines as line J and line P respectively. Perpendicular Lines Step 1. Draw a line with point W mark on it. Step 2. Without removing the ruler, place set square on top of the scale. Align the set square so that its edge is at point W. Step 3. Remove the ruler and place it on the edge of the set. Step 4. Remove the set square and draw a line along the ruler passing through the point W. Step 5. Remove the ruler, the drawing of the two lines, and name your line, line A and line B respectively. For learning task 1, tell whether the given pair of lines are parallel, intersecting, or perpendicular. Number 1. 
Number two. Number three. Number four. And number five. Try to answer this. For learning task 2, identify the highlighted pair of lines in its object. Learning task 3, identify the given pair of lines as either parallel perpendicular or intersecting. Number one, line PQ and line EL are perpendicular lines. Number two, line GF and line CX are parallel lines. Continue answering number three, four, and five. Learning task 4. True or false? Write true on the blank if the statement is correct and write false if the statement is incorrect. Number 1. Parallel lines never intersect or cross each other. Number 2. Intersecting lines never cross or meet at any point at all. Then try to answer number 3, 4, and 5. Number 3, perpendicular lines are a special type of intersecting lines that intersect and form four square corners. Number 4, the two lines cross each other at one point are called intersecting lines. Number 5, the distance between two parallel lines is always stays the same. For learning task 5, draw the following lines in the box and identify the lines form. Number 1, line CD and line DE. Number 2, line CA and line RE. Number 3, Line BE and Line ST. You now can identify the different kinds of lines, namely parallel, perpendicular, and intersecting. Remember that parallel lines are lines that do not meet. Intersecting lines are lines that cross each other. Perpendicular lines are lines that intersect and form square corners. We can use ruler and set square in drawing different types of line. For your learning task 6, write PE if the line is perpendicular, PA if parallel, and IN if intersecting on the blank before the number. Number one, what type of lines does the picture represent? Number two, number three, number four, what type of lines does the picture represent? A, perpendicular lines and parallel lines. B. Parallel lines and intersecting lines. C. Intersecting lines and perpendicular lines. D. None of the above. For learning task 7, on a piece of paper, draw the following lines using ruler and set square. Name the line with a small letter. Number 1. Intersecting lines. Number 2, parallel lines. 3, perpendicular lines. 4, line intersecting 2 parallel lines. 5, line intersecting 2 perpendicular lines. 
in your notebook, write your personal insights about the lesson using the prompts below. I understand that blank. I realize that blank. I need to learn more about blank. Maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Hanggang isa muli, samahan niyo ako sa mga susunod pang mga videos. Huwag kakalimot na mag-subscribe. Pwede kayong mag-comments, mag-like at i-share ang ating mga videos. Hanggang sa muli, paalam!